update at noon. We do expect to hear from EBR Mayor President Sharon Westenbroom on efforts to provide personal protective equipment for first responders and hospitals. It's that acronym PPE that you've likely heard during this pandemic. NBC Local 33's Courtney Williams is live this morning outside of MOSEP where items have been being uh, have been collected. But Courtney, we do expect a new site to open later today. Hey, good morning, Jaren. Well, as you just mentioned, many people have been coming here to Mosep, which is right here on Harding Boulevard, to drop off any uh, personal protective equipment, as you just mentioned, for the local hospitals and first responders. But there is a new distribution center that is expected to be announced later on this morning. Mayor President Sharon Weston Broome will be joined along with officials from local hospitals, companies, as well as foundations, and that includes um, Baton Rouge General, Baton Rouge Area Foundation, Baton Rouge Health District, Mary Burr Perkins Cancer Center, Coca. Cola and Exxon Mobil, just to name a few. Healthcare workers say that the rapid spread of COVID-19 is creating major medical supply sh shortages. COVID-19 patients require a significant amount of personal protective equipment, or also known as PPE. Now, there are several different types, and that includes face shields, gloves, goggles and glasses, gowns, head covers, masks, mas respirators, and also shoe covers, and that is helped to just prevent the spread of any viruses from the medical professional to a patient. And many in the community have come together to help make masks from home and send them to those hospitals just to help with that demand. We assure you our hospitals will get the supplies because we're working collaboratively uh, with them. And once again, I can't thank our hospitals enough. Broom, along with those Officials are expected to speak at 11 o'clock, and that will be at the PPE transfer and distribution site um, that is in the 9400 block of Plank Road. So it's not too far here from MOSEP, so you can make sure you stay tuned for that, that it begins at 11 o'clock. And, of course, we will be live streaming that on our website at brproud.com. You can also find just more information on uh, as we get more developments on our website. And also, if you down our, download our free BR Proud app. Reporting live here at MOSEP, Courtney Williams, NBC Local 33 News.